Hey YouTube, it's a trendy socialite. It is Easter Sunday. Happy Easter. Happy Resurre Resurrection Sunday to all of you. I hope that you are doing well and that you're enjoying. Well, here in North Carolina, it's an absolutely beautiful Easter Sunday. What, I mean, what an awesome day to celebrate um, my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ's resurrection. Um, as you can see, I look a little different. Ting! Yes, so I have officially joined the lace front wig wearing family. That is what I'm wearing today. Uh, after I took out my kinky twist uh, Friday night and Saturday, I wasn't really sure what um, protective style I wanted to do next because I am on a protective style challenge from it was actually the end of February until my big chop anniversary, my nappyversary, which is June 26. So basically, yeah, for the next uh, almost three months or so. Um, three out of the last four months I will be wearing uh, protective styles. So yeah, I wasn't really sure what I was going to wear. And so I thought, you know, I like to change it up. I miss my curls tremendously. I miss my hair. I miss being able to touch it, play in it, and do stuff with it. So I said, you know, rather than something um, permanent, meaning <laughs> It's something that I won't be able to take off and um, enjoy my curls or do something with my own hair if I wanted to. I decided that I was going to um, invest in a lace front. So um, my mom and I went to the beauty supply store yesterday because she was in. She wears wigs a lot, like almost exclusively now. Um, she has some beautiful wigs. So we went to the beauty supply store. She was looking for one and I was looking for one. So that's what we did yesterday. I ended up buying two lace fronts. Um, I'll do a review on the other one when I wear it for the first time. So yeah, this one is by Free Trust Equal. Um, it's a lace front, as I said, no glue, no tape necessary. And this style is a shake and go. This style is called Leisha. Leisha. I'm calling her Lily. I'll put a picture up of it as well. So, yeah, I'm, I'm new to this whole lace front thing. I don't really know what to do. I read the instructions up here, watched a couple of YouTube videos, and I'm like, really, it's not that simple, is it? And it pretty much is. Um, this wig is soft the hair is really really soft the color oh my god the color alone is is worth me having it I mean this is probably like I've I haven't seen people with as good a color job <laughs> as this wig has it is um four twenty seven and thirty um colors in here absolutely love it like, I'm thinking, oh, I could really, this coloration sort of fits my face, you know? Um, and that's one good thing about wigs, y'all, is that, I said y'all, ah, my southernness is coming out. <laughs> anyway, that's one good thing about wigs and weaves and things like that, is that you can try hair colors out. And especially with wigs, because they're not like weaves that you either glue in or you sew in and you have to keep them for weeks on, at a time. Um, a wig, you can plop it on. If you don't like it, then you just get a different wig. Just get a different color. Alright, so back to the wig. I just had like a major disaster. <laughs> my little earring display fell. Oh my god. Anyway. Um, oh, here's something I forgot to put up. So, Back to the wig. Uh, yeah, in terms of the color, I just love this color. I mean, this is not something I would ever do myself. Um, but I love it. I think it looks, you know, decent on me and my coloring and, and things like that. Um, like I said, the wig is very soft. It was easy to put on. Um, I love the color. The only thing that I'm, I guess I don't care for as much is um, I feel like it could be layered a little bit more especially like right in here like this side is layered pretty well because this is the side that they want you to kind of bang out and have the long um, side kind of swoopy bang this side not so much um, 
So I found myself today kind of constantly having to run my fingers through it or brush it to kind of give it the fullness and the curliness. More fullness. I don't really necessarily want it curly, but just full. But other than that, I don't have any complaints on, the, on this wig. I doubt this will be something I wear in the heat of the summer because it's only 80 degrees right now and I'm about to burn up. Um, unless I'm going to be inside the whole time and it's going to be air conditioned. Yeah, I don't think that this is something I'm going to wear like all day on a Saturday running errands because it's hot. All this hair around my neck and stuff hanging on my shoulders. Yeah, so this is Leisha. I'm going to call her Lily. Free trust equal. I got it from my book, Beauty Supply Store. I will check online to see what the going rate for it is. Hopefully it is cheaper because I actually may get this in a slightly different color. I tried on a 1B30 or a 430. I don't remember. That was a little bit darker than this. It wasn't quite the color mix as this. And I absolutely loved it. So if you're interested, pick up Leisha from Free Tress Equal. Um, I'm not sure. I, like I said, I have two wigs. I have a Jada, which is a really super curly. It's It almost looks like um, a straw set, sort of, on natural, a straw set on natural hair. Like, it looks like that's how it would be. It is, like, super Diana Ross, Shaka Khan, big. Um, but at the same time, I was playing with it last night and did a little bit of styling to it. And I can make it work, so I'm excited to wear that. I may wear that to work tomorrow. That should be interesting. Um, people always say I always change my hair and then they don't recognize me. I mean, really? My hair changes that much that you don't know who I am? Okay. Anyway, <sighs> I need to do some other videos. So I'm not going to drag this conversation on much longer because I will be back. I love you all. I hope that you're doing well. And if you have any questions or comments about Alicia or me, <laughs> feel free to leave them below. But, and also, tell me how you feel about this new YouTube format and the fact that the subscribe button is up here in the corner and the comments and the like and and the um, my video the video description boxes are below. I don't know how I'm feeling about that. I doubt they'll go back and change it, but I'm just like, eh. I can take it or leave it with this structure. So let me know how you feel. Alright? I hope you're well. Bye.